many people want to know more about over-the-counter options or simple things like changing fiber intake, um, fluid intake, and physical exercise and the management of, of constipation. Um, and so I don't know what you think about, you know, that, that that may be really helpful for patients with kind of occasional constipation, maybe not as severe symptoms as those with that you or I might see. But with regards to the over-the-counter, I'm glad you asked that question because there is a lot of new over-the-counter treatment approaches. You know, traditional ones we're used to are stool softeners. You know, uh, we're used to magnesium compounds. We're used to uh, polyethylene glycol. Uh, we're used to um, uh, bisacordal. So, and, and we're used to fiber, right? These have been traditionally out there but not a lot of newer studies. What we found, new studies came out were comparing Senna with a magnesium. Very unique study, showing that Senna and magnesium work very well, a, a randomized control study. Another study looked at fruit-based compounds. We are looking at kiwi fruit. We're looking at mango, uh, several other fruits that have been used. So there are some exciting um, over-the-counter. Some, some are looking at a certain fructans, fructo-oligosaccharides and so on. There is some good evidence that some fiber supplements, some newer fiber supplements, combination fiber supplements, fruits. Uh, I mean, there is the uh, older papers that we published five years ago looking at uh, plums, yeah. you know, good old prunes, and that was effective. Then we looked at another compound called suprafiber, which I'm sure I'm told is not being available anymore, but suprafiber is a fiber com comprising of plum, pomegranate, and acacia, and so on. That can be very effective. So these are newer fiber, which is a mix of soluble and insoluble fiber that can also be effective in the management of constipation. Particularly, you're looking at milder forms and occasional constipation products. Right, which many people might have a hard time with. That's a good point. And may not, may not want prescription medicine. 